Hey everybody, this is Jason at Alorium Technology. Very pleased to share another short video with you. And this demonstration is another one we did for Maker Faire Milwaukee. Just a really simple demo of the board being used with some common stuff off the shelf. Now I just want to be clear, there's currently no acceleration taking place here. There's no accelerator block we're running on our board to control any of this. It's all just running on the microcontroller. And so what we've got here is we've got, of course, our accelerate board. And then it's connected to a breadboard and sitting on that is a color TFT LCD display. And sitting next to that is a 40 LED NeoPixel shield. And finally, we've got a three axis accelerometer. It's an ADXL 345 hooked up through I squared C to the accelerator board. And what I can do with it, if you look over to the right there, is I can actually drive the LEDs, but it's kind of hard to see in the light like this. So just like the last time, we're gonna go ahead and dim the lights here. Now, as I mentioned, the ADXL345 is hooked up through I squared C, and that is just kind of set up as I go left and right, back and forth, it moves back and forth, up and down is up and down, and that, so that's X and Y. The Z axis actually changes the LED color, so when I bounce it like this, it changes the LEDs. And I've got a simple sketch set up that's kind of like a game. It's basically random, so as you drive the LED around the shield, um, after so many times of it moving, it'll tell you either you won or lost. It's not exactly random, but it's mostly random. But it was kind of fun for people to play with. So we'll go ahead and give you a chance to look at it again. And the thing that we're doing here is simply demonstrating that we can do simple things like talking through the I squared C, the LCD, the TFT LCD is connected through SPY. And of course, the, the NeoPixel shield is connected just through one of the regular data pins. Um, I have a lot of fun with these NeoPixel shields. They're awesome. And being able to combine that with the LCD kind of fulfills one of the early things we were hoping to be able to just show as part of what our board can do and is kind of an extension a bit of the very first demonstration that we put or the very first video we did with this NeoPixel shield. So that's it for today. Again, just another demo. If people are wondering, hey, what can I do with it? Does it actually work with some of this stuff? It does. We're looking forward to sharing more. Thanks for taking a few minutes to watch. We'll talk with you soon. Bye.